Hello everyone, in the next video from Total War Attila, Age of Charlemagne and Kingdom of Mercia campaign Let's continue our conquer of Iberian Peninsula and also the Europe But first, let's start with Iberian Peninsula My question is, can we can we give them a battle? Certainly not, uh, wall strength 93% I will have to deal again with with many watchtowers, and they are they are really really frustrating. By the way, I feel like CA should do something about about that. So first of all, the siege should become a bit more meaningful in a way that uh, really uh, either defending or attacking the city. Uh, makes difference. I feel like the units besieging the city should suffer the attrition. I think the idea from uh, three kingdoms, which is quite simplified, the, the the supplies, is really is really nice because you you force you at some point to uh, give give them a battle to 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 go on with with the siege, and also it forces you to think about how to plan your movements when to attack, uh, about the timing and so on. I, I feel like in those older total wars it's not the case and, and sie sieges are really... I mean they are... for both sides they are pretty annoying because uh, you're, wa you're wasting your time on keeping the siege. Uh, I could actually attack but that's not the point. The enemies also waste time because they have to wait. They can of course sally forth but they do not stand a chance, but for me, besieging the city, there is no attrition penalty or nothing, unless it's winter. But on Iberian Peninsula, it doesn't it doesn't have mm, any effect. So yeah, they should be should, they should become more meaningful. I don't know how to do it. I, I certainly feel like the attrition for uh, besieging forces should be uh, should be in place. I think that's the that's the case for Rome to Total War. And also the, the the supplies mechanic, it's it's really worth uh, consideration. Uh, but how to do it properly, or even g give it even more uh, more meaning, I, I have no I have no clue. Because th they could be spectacular, um, but you cannot make them spectacular for for every each and every uh, siege battle. So. I suppose that in games, in potential games like I don't know, Total War, uh, Middle Earth, Battle of Middle Earth, so so just Lord of the Rings, Total War, I can imagine spectacular battles for either Osgiliath, uh, Helm's Deep, Minas Tirith, Black Gate of Mordor, and so on. And I can feel like you can even in somehow script them so AI uh, performs certain actions uh, or they get uh, additional. Uh, reinforcements that would be that would be really cool of course people would complain that well it's not okay that the ai gets additional forces or he knows what to do or mm, so th that would happen that's for sure but i feel like you, you could really make them make them great i think the great example is uh, ultimate general civil war where battles in to some degree scripted and AI behaves really like he knows what he's doing uh, and that's really cool because that forces you to think out of the box many times and also use real life tactics that, that should be also implemented in Total Wars I, I, I'm pretty sure that would uh, play out really nice but anyway mm, let's continue let me take a look what we want to do I'm trying to find some task for for my army stationing in Almeria. Uh, let me take a look at province details. Military presence 19, and public order is plus 16 at, at that point. But I can keep fleet over here, right? Yeah, fleet boost bo boost that uh, bo boost that as well. Okay, so let's march towards. Uh, Calatrava. I think the next target will be Merida in and Caceres for St. Alban's champions and the Swords of Mercia will focus on Seville uh, if possible. Okay, 
but we need to go to northeastern Europe and here uh, yes science of the right to sprung okay bold next turn we will attack uh, Utrecht under Westphalia command okay no money available so that's the time to end the turn but first there is some promotion for my priest how can I help you I think you cannot uh, but we can give you additional of 40 and also no zeal plus one perfect now we can end the turn okay looks like kingdom of Asturias has two armies that's fine okay that was that was Duke of Provence I didn't notice what he's besieging. Oh, he's besieging Merida, right? Let's go over here. Where is Merida? Oh, yes, of course. That's what I said, yeah? They are going to attack Merida. Of course, their army is weak. I don't think they will give them a battle. They will try to starve them out. So, we need to... First we need to conquer Cordoba, which is quite quite easy. Let's switch to forced march. Okay, it doesn't give you give me a huge boost. Let's march towards uh, towards Merida. Mm -hmm. That's the next target. Perfect. Mm, now let me take a look at events because there's so many of them. Population surplus. War declared, Emirate of Cordoba, Galatian Separatists. Oh! Uh huh. Okay. Interesting. Do you still fight with uh, Kingdom of Asturias? Let me take a look at that. Uh, raiding, yes, I know that those are um, Italian Separatists. Household lost, uh, Byzantine turncoat, corruption, I understand. Yeah, that's sad. And trade gain, diplomatic tone, trade income plus 20% trade agreement hires. Cool. This man has a talent for persuasion and sensible compromise. What a great man. And also rank gain for Fiodric. Uh, where you are? You are the governor here. You are the. Okay, you are Fiodric. My king is also Fiodric, right? Mm, and what we what we would like to give you? Sweet talker. Or maybe authority and zeal. Maybe let's go with uh, trainer and also motivator, so campaign movement range. Just in case we would need to assign him as as a general. So that's it. Mm, you are in forced march. We could we could give you a battle for Cordoba. Wall strength is 83%. And look at that army. They're so weak. Uh, what about giving them battle now? Yeah, let's go for it. Uh, scout terrain. Okay. That should be straightforward. That's the inter interesting tactic by Duchy of Provence. So, they are they, they know that they cannot uh, win win the battle. So, they are taking their army moving to to different different province and and uh, attacking it. Of course, that's because they are at war with uh, Kingdom of Asturias, so that's the reason. From which direction we would like to enter? Uh, I suppose from that direction, because there is a, there's a gap in the wall. Um, we'll try to destroy the Watchtower. It has only 61%. Perfect. What's your range? So Onager will be placed over there. Maybe over there. Perfect. We will protect you by keeping cavalry close, just in case. And bulk of my forces will form the line over there. It can be quite quite wide. At the end of the day, we will probably form three free uh, ranks. You gentlemen, please give up on that siege equipment. We don't need it. Uh, spearmen behind such a manner royal thanks supporting you behind as well and general 
himself at the center. We can... Do we want to create a group? Not really. Let's start the battle. Uh, target watchtower, please. And what's the range of that watchtower? Up to here. Okay. So, let's send my forces forward. Oh. Again, lovely, lovely boulders. Oh, there is a speech. Okay, that's the end of the speech. Oh! Watchtower destroyed. How accurate it was. Target the wall now. Oh, how nice it is. Mm -hmm. So let me grab my forces and let's get even even closer. It's no, no, no point waiting. Okay. Perfection. Another target. Another side of the wall. Some of you died on those on those walls, I suppose. Let's spectate that. A oh, beautiful mountain in the back. Mm -hmm. They are flying. Wow, this is so inaccurate. Was that accurate? Only one hit. Whoa, my archers are hitting them. Mm-hmm. You guys are almost almost Oh. Oh stop! Jesus, re respect that, please. Yeah, the city is ablaze, like always. Okay, some boulders flying. Boom. Two hits. Okay, yeah. The wall he here is almost fully destroyed. Mm -hmm. Are they retreating? Whoa. Okay. I feel like there are some skirmishers in the area. Did they already... Oh my god. Jesus. Just don't kill civilians, please. Mm -hmm. Another unit gone. Perfection. Okay. Uh, royal... Royal Fangs. Let's, let's get in. Uh-huh. Form this way. And my archers. Slightly forward, please. Of course, we don't know where where enemies are, like always. Yeah, just just keep keep practicing, guys. You can destroy it another portion of the wall if you if you wish so. Mhm. Mm I, I suppose general is uh, standing somewhere here. There are civilians. Hello. Looks like they don't give a shit about what's going on around. You could at least try to extinguish the fire, but yeah, you don't care. That's fine. Who 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 would care? Perfection. Another part of the wall destroyed. Do you want to fire somewhere else? Keep practicing. Okay, my archers uh, are very close, supporting royal fangs. What about that watchtower? Okay, out of out of range. Perfect. Let's go destroy barricade, please. Two first units, mm, two, three other units. We will form a little group, supportive group for you. Interesting. Who, bu who built tents inside the city? Usually nobody is doing that. Okay, th whoa. Those are gorgeous armors. Look at that. From where did you take them? They are not from that era. Is anybody wearing such an armor? Let me take a look. That's my general. Absolutely not. That's the that's the armor from from ancient times. Come on. I'm pretty sure. Look at that. That that looks like the Roman armor, or Spartan armor. Even those helmets look like ancient ones. I'm pretty sure this this is a copy paste from Rom Total War. Yeah, I think so. Well, they they look spectacular. Okay, where is General? Can we finally find him? Okay, let's send my warriors forward. Three other units behind. 
There you are, buddy. Here you are. Hello. We got him, boys. Mm -hmm. Form a battle line. Let's go. Charge! We will out outline him from the left. Oh no, he's retreating. Stop. Stop falling back. Jason, come on. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Oh god. Terrible death. Okay, yep, the battle is over. No casualties? No casualties. Perfection. Okay, now we need to... Oh, that was Pepin. Commanding enemy forces. Now we need to repair Cordoba. Because that's gonna drain our our income like always. Uh, peacefully occupying. Uh, Eighty percent Christianity. Oh, we need to either send my priest. We need to take care about uh, Christianity. Eighty percent. That's too low. Abbey is built. Interesting. Via. Uh, I can convert it to hostel. Demolish. Church school, absolutely. Master hall. I have master hall in Almeria, so I will destroy one in Almeria. I will repair the one here, and I will also repair forge. I don't mind. Okay, perfect. Cordoba belongs to us, so the next target is Seville. Two armies stationing in the in the area. That's fine. We will manage it. Not a big deal. Uh, the army San Albas champions is marching towards uh, towards Merida. What's the quickest way to get in there? Oh, through that territory. Perfect. Okay, so that ends up our our situation in our moves in uh, on Iberian Peninsula. Now we need to decide what to build because there is some additional money available, like always. Looks like our income is getting better and better, which is lovely. That's what I want to see. There's a few open slots. Oh, first of all, uh, cavalry. And my question is, do we want two onagers? So two cavalry, two onagers? Um, why not? I feel like two cavalry is enough. We are relying heavily on on our foot infantry, melee infantry. Of course, cavalry is great, but I feel like I don't need it so much. I can achieve also a lot by using onagers. On the other hand, having three cavalry and one onager. That's also also cool. The only good option by having two onagers is that I can really speed up the uh, the siege battles. That's for sure. And since we are the offensive side, I may need those onagers. So two cavalry, two onagers. I think that may that may work quite nice. I could also give up on one Fang spearman unit and get one more cavalry instead. Yeah. But we'll we'll go for two two onagers. Okay. Yeah, I really think about the giving up on one Fang Spearman since they are my they are my center most of the time. I don't really need five of them. I can I can live with uh, four, so I can secure flanks by putting my royal fangs, and I also can get free cavalry instead so let's g give up on one uh, thank spearman and let's go for one more cavalry perfection of course that's gonna cost us a lot in terms of future income uh, but this is fine now the question is what we would like to do with rest of the money it's not much so maybe maybe let's accumulate it mm. This is the option. Okay, we have... Wait a second. I don't need the Master Hall here. Okay, let's, let's destroy it. We will build over the uh, Hospice. 
where is hospice that that's for sure we really really need that that point we can also go back to iberian peninsula okay we need to build chapel over there actually we have uh, monastery in hand so religious influence plus six christianity we could also recruit a uh, priest if we would like to we have only one mm, progressive which gives me minus 20 percent penalty due to presence of other religions okay yeah sure let's recruit her mm -hmm. it's gonna be useful since there is no app cost for 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 spies for priests and uh, any other agents that's that's fine we can easily recruit them and now let's go to northeastern europe okay uh, that's my spy let's find out what's going on over there okay that army is not growing up so quick look at diplomacy where is westphalia where you are you are here no allies still same wars ongoing we are going to declare war on you. you declare war. Yet. Boom. Thank you. And we are marching on Utrecht. Mm -hmm. Oh, here I have four cavalry. And I do not have onagers. Okay. Worth noting. I really need uh, onagers. We will wait, of course. No, no need to need to force battle. Let's go to Osnabrück. I suppose they will start forming the the army if they if they have any uh, an, any money available. You can also disrupt settlement. Oh, inflict minor damage on multiple buildings in target settlement. Warriors Hall, farms. Sabotage building. Inflict major damage upon a specific building in target area. Uh, I think Warriors Hall is responsible for units recruitment, right? Let's try to sabotage it. And let's see. Agent activity. Failure. Okay. But you survived. That's good. Yeah, at least you tried. Of course, our trade agreement is also dissolved, unfortunately. Uh, which uh, decreased my my income. That's fine. And there's one more thing I I wanted to check, and that's Emirate of Cordoba. Okay, so you are fighting with both Galatian separatists and Duchy of Provence, but you are not fighting with Kingdom of Asturias, though. Okay, that's fine. That's really fine. I think we can end the turn. Okay, they are sending the army to uh, stop the siege of, to prevent the siege of Merida. Of course, Duchy of Provence do not stand a chance. They do not even have an army. What's that? Sune, uh, Sune Fruf with Ethelric. Uh, protective, okay. Well, let's give them a blessing. That will of course decrease my control, but I don't mind. The, the more, um, I mean, personally, the more kids, the better. It's not true, but in total war, absolutely, I agree. But only in total war. Mm, okay, Cordoba. Oh, no, you are taxed. You are not taxed. Of course, you are not. Does it increase my? Okay, it doesn't increase very much my my income okay uh, what in at Andalus of course hospice we need to increase sanitation mm, and also we could go for cathedral if we would like to uh, first let's uh, start inspiring populace please Much appreciate it okay so we have empty slot in Almeria uh, fertility is good so the obvious choice is to build farms in an Almeria okay and now, why do I have two forges? Oh my god, really? Let's dismantle the one in Hain. Let's keep the one in Cordoba. 
uh, we can go for cathedral if we'd like to go for it uh, we could also build barracks why not it's always nice to to have them of course i don't really need because i'm not going to recruit any any forces so maybe cathedral is better option unless we can invest in economy somewhere we can wine merchant in valencia of course we we, we go for it and we can forget about any other choices now uh, let's grab Santa Albas champions. Let's start moving them towards Merida. Actually, that's good that uh, Kingdom of Asturias are sending their army towards Merida, so we can we can beat that army at the very beginning and the other army uh, stationing in Seville. Yeah, that should work. That should work really well. Perfect. Uh, they are still raiding my Austrasia. Are you going to die finally? I'm wondering how much you are you are raiding. Uh, war declared. Obodrite Saxon separatists? What's that? That's the first time I see that faction. Population surplus. Let me take a look at diplomacy. What's that? Do I, do I see them on my diplomacy map? Not really. Okay. Uh, Bohemia, would you like to trade with me? You have the ear of my people. No. Do not waste words. Military alliance? No. Uh, not that. Oh, non-aggression pact we have already. Okay, so never mind. Okay, so there is a, such a faction. Obdrite. I don't know where exactly, but they exist. That's for sure. Okay. Interesting that Kingdom of the Lombards, they still have Arverne and Grenoble over there. Nobody really captured it. Bohemia could, but they didn't decide. <laughs> this is also funny that Bohemia captured Pavia. And, and they are the, the, their starting point, is summer, star, starting point is somewhere here. Okay. Mm, what we could do next? Okay, Duchy of Frisia. What are you doing? Yeah, your moves are weird. I think we also need to neutralize you at some point. Oh! Oh no, I, I told that those are uh, Nordalbingas, but they are Saxon rebels. Okay. Whew. That's fine. Uh, looks like we can end turn. There's nothing else to do. Peace treaty. And you offer me 2000. Nope. I'm sorry. What the hell is that? Why am I supporting Duchy of Frisia? Well, that's the army of Westphalia. They were they were hiding here. What? Oh, I ha I can decline attack. No way. We <laughs> there is no chance we can we can win it. No, there is too many. Too many good units. Look at that. Herb guard. Whoa, they they look cool. No, there's also good cavalry. No chance we can win it. I I would certainly decline attack. Of course I would like to support you, Charles. But we don't stand a, we do not stand a chance. No, let's decline attack. Oh, they've retreated. Is that army beaten though? Possibly. I'm also wondering whether that affects my relations with Duchy of Frisia. I really wonder. Oh, Imperium level. Supreme. Your power is supreme. Woo! Awesome. Objective complete. Legacy forged. Through his mighty deeds, the king must build a legacy. Thus, inured to the destructive power of time and death, he will endure. Okay, and the mission issued another one. Hold 110 settlements. <laughs> Funny. Okay. Oh, let me take a look at my relations with Duchy of Frisia. <laughs> they are still improving, despite we didn't give them a, a battle. Okay, I don't think they will decide to attack Aachen. The garrison is quite solid over there. Mm, of course, we will For suffer Lord, some attrition. I wouldn't mind if they decide to support Utrecht. 
But if they combine both armies, that that may hurt us. Okay, either way, the double-headed eagles are ready, and we are moving uh, forward. I'm looking at where we are going to suffer attrition. I can get there. Okay, interesting. Let's go over here. Are we going to suffer attrition? Slightly closer, yeah. If I move, move, move further. I will suffer attrition, but I could just give up on on the roads and station somewhere here. And I'm not suffering attrition. I I'm, I will not even su suffer attrition over there. I suffered a little, but that's fine. Okay, so we are moving towards uh, Westphalia. I'm thinking about keeping the battle now, but this is not necessary. Also, now it makes really really sense to have so so much cavalry ready. That's cool. Uh, you are really annoying. I will eliminate you soon. Uh, what to do? 24,000 available. Oh, that's because I uh, I reached the, the objective. What was the objective? Uh, that's the primary objective. Bonus objective. Uh, Ofa with his head. Okay. Oh, there is so many of them. Maintain at least 90 public order across all provinces. That should be done. Come on. Victory objectives. Reach impelling room level 7. It's still not level 7? Current total 68. Okay. Fair enough. I don't even know what kind of imperium level we are. Can I find out about that? Oh my god. Imperium. Terrifying. Food. Minus 24%. Upkeep cost plus 23. Really? That hurts me. Where is the Imperium level? I don't e I don't even know. Okay, fair enough. Thank you game for, for telling me that. Mm, what we are <coughs> supposed to... Oh! Merida is in the hands of... For Duchy of Provence. Plenty of money. 32 minutes on my timer. So I think we can Round still afford some, some actions. Let's switch to non-stance. Let's move, move forward. Out. You're going towards Merida. Oh, that's Asturias. You are not uh, besieging Merida, so I will do so. We can even give them battle instantly. But why do we need to do so? We don't need to. We will wait. Uh, we don't know anything about uh, watchtowers. Uh, we will encircle you. We will wait. Okay. Mm Situation in Cordoba is improving. Also, I can select from technology now. That's very nice. Uh, sanitation, okay. In Toledo, it's still low. Uh, in Pamplona, plenty of options as well. Even undeveloped land in Zaragoza, okay. We can go for gallery. And we will do so. This is always a nice option. We can also build palace if we'd like to. Uh, oh. We could build something in Oviedo, and we will do. And we'll of course build hospice. Where is hospice? Church school. Hospice is over there. Boom. Perfect. We could go for salt trader. Six thousand for it. That's a lot. What in Lyon? In Lyon, can we hospice? Build hospice? It's already built. It is built. Okay. So not really. Uh, but we could... No, church school as well, not really. Oh. So we would need to build chapel, I guess. It's not a very interesting option. Fertility is also very poor. What about sanitation? Sanitation is high. Uh, I would either go for surface mine or water mill. Let's go for surface mine. It's not a big deal, yeah. Okay, still 20,000 available. Huge, huge. Let's go through all of those uh, settlements uh, here. Fertility very good, so let's improve farms. Uh, empty slot. I don't I don't see anything interesting for that empty slot. In Nice, 
I wouldn't mind to build a guardhouse over there. Let's be, let's destroy hostel and we'll be, build guardhouse because if Bohemia decides to attack me, they may decide to go along the Mediterranean coastline. So let's be prepared for it. Next, uh, Leon, also undeveloped land. Uh, we can build tribunal. We will do so. Uh, Fourteen thousand left. So we are moving north. What about Poitiers? Uh, nothing interesting for now. What about Paris? Sanitation is high. What about Master Goldsmith? That's a great investment. Let's go for it. Mm, still 8,000 available. That's a lot. That's really a lot. Uh, Rams. Uh, what's the sanitation? 14. Iron mine? We have any better option? I don't think so. What about Aachen? Here we could build siege workshop, but that's not something I really need. 4,000 left. That's not too much. Uh, sanitation is also not great. Oh, here. Fertility is poor though. Manorial court, why not? I'm pretty sure in Greenland of Alec there is an empty slot. Yes, it is. Even two. But we can't really, really build anything. We can improve ship mill if we would like to. Uh, in Pictland, in Pictland we could go for Priori. At least we would increase public order, why not? In Bamburg, nothing, unfortunately. Almost 3,000 left. Let's accumulate it, because I don't have any better idea for for rest of my funds, I think we can easily uh, accumulate it. Let's go back to Iberian Peninsula though. Now I think I could even afford the 5th army. Wouldn't mind. Would be awesome. Uh, what's going on uh, here? Okay, so we are stationing in Cordoba for a while. So we will capture Merida and after we capture Merida we will declare war on the Kingdom of Asturias. Unfortunately, I really like you guys but in, in politics, in international politics or in geopolitics, there is no, uh, there is no good relations. There are only interests, you know. So I'm very sorry, yeah, but that's a harsh truth. Anyway, we have technology to select from. Uh, and professional soldiers are finally developed. I think that's why my uh, income increased heavily by having four yeah, armies. The income. Uh, uh, upkeep cost decreased. I don't know by how much, but certainly it uh, uh, decreased. Oh, I can upgrade my archers. Uh, this is not the ar upgrade I would like to have, but if I need so. Can I recruit uh, better units? Oh, I don't have barracks. I would like to have highly experienced uh, ones. I could, I could have rank around 8 or 7. Would be awesome. Let's go back to technology though. Finally, let's go for monasticism and after monasticism we will go to church curse. So first we can build church hospital and that's the most important uh, thing to do. And the other one is glass workshop. We have that in uh, in Wales, I think, in Deganway. Mm, so yeah, monasticism first and then church care. Awesome. Oh, that is. There is a couple of interesting technologies. Not not something I really need, but we don't have any other options. We still can go for Master Smith. Uh, wooden Wall, definitely not. We don't need it. Uh, warrior Culture. Wrestling Arena, we, we also don't need it. Conquerors, not really. So we yeah, have from military technologies only Master Smith is interesting. Even third training is not needed, and that's because our units start with very high experience, so getting additional one is not a it's not a big deal. Uh, okay, 39 minutes, uh, everything done. Unless we can still take a look at diplomacy map. Oh, our relations with Bohemia are deteriorating. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. Also with Eastphalia. So we are expecting a conflict soon. It's funny. Lombard separatists like li like me, but they're still raiding my uh, my my province. How nice of you. 
Uh, Kingdom of Carloman. Our relations are deteriorating despite the fact we are fighting against Westphalia, you bastards. Also, with North Albingia deteriorating, Papal State and don't Papal State has, I, I don't re give a shit about you, bastards. I still remember excommunication. Uh, also, my relations with uh, Republic of Venice deteriorating. Oh, there is a huge penalty for great power. It was 13 minus 13 minus 30 last time and now it's uh, minus 60 everyone hates me seriously what about Asturias? even Asturias will start hating me Galatian separatists like uh, like me which is nice and Emirate of Cordoba still as well okay fair enough okay so uh, that would be it for today I hope you enjoyed and hopefully see you in the next one where Oh, God, please. Maybe this time we will finish off uh, Duchy of Provence. And also we will continue our war in northern, northeastern Europe against Westphalia. And probably prepare for another big war against either Eastphalia, Nordalbingia or maybe uh, Bohemia. We will find out. So once again, thank you and see you next time. Goodbye.